I want to take a moment and I want to explain the big thing I think House Republicans need to do in 2016. A great frustration in our party is that we've not had a real national majority in seven years. We've controlled Congress, sure, but not the presidency, and we need to. I don't think that many people are walking away from this presidency thinking, that went well. <laughs> we still have enormous problems. But now, the country is divided. And the federal government has grown arrogant, it's grown condescending, and outright paternalistic. So, I'd say what we have seen in the past seven years is the illusion of success. The left may be good at tactics. But tactics are not solutions. They can win an election, but they can't win a mandate. They can make you popular, but they can't solve problems. They can help a party, but they can't save a country. So why in the world would we want to act that way? If we want to do what we believe in, then we need a mandate from the people. And if we want a mandate, then we need to offer ideas. And if we want to offer ideas, then we need to actually have ideas. That's where the House Republicans come in. So our number one goal for next year is to put together a complete alternative to the left's agenda. <laughs> put together a positive agenda and take it to the American people. Give the people of this country the choice that they have been yearning for. And if next year this House can say that we have done that, then we will have done our job. Then the people will know that we stand for a more prosperous, a more secure, and yes, a more confident America. And the rest, well, the rest, the rest will be up to the people, as it should be. Thank you very much for attending today. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you.